Sorry, I almost fell. Quiet back here. At least the birds were chirping earlier. Now, I mean, super quiet. You can hear a mouse fart. I mean, it is quiet. You know what? I forgot. I keep forgetting. I can't. I have this with me. I've got a whistle, like a dog whistle of some sort. I don't. I'm not sure. I know it's loud, but in its own sense, it's not like. Oh, I'll show you. Yeah, made the birds chirp. <laughs> oh wow. Actually, I just saw three or four, bir four birds get up. That's how cold I am. I can barely talk. It got cold quick. And then I had a couple birds start chirping as soon as I blew it. I mean, I'm assuming it's a dog whistle. I don't know. Very piercing. Sound. All of these new trees just snapped off high, midway and real high. It's all new. I, I was telling everyone in the last couple of videos back, that, a few videos back, that no wind. We just had, you know, steady rain, soaking rain, but no wind. So your guess is as good as mine. Start heading back towards the beginning. Batteries are getting low. And of course, as soon as I want to pan over here, the sun pokes out bright as never, and I can't see anything, at least through the camera. probably good for spotting things but it's not good for me for looking through the screen and it's warm it feels good like that but I can't see anything probably, like I said probably good for you guys looking but it's not good for me I can't see anything oh, man I'm cold Let me see if I can angle it, get out of it a little bit, and see if I can get up here maybe and get a couple of shots that I haven't been able to get from a different angle. There's a lot that goes on back in that corner where I'm pointing. Back in there. Actually, all along that back side. I'm forever catching them standing there watching me from the wood edge. That's where I, I was telling you I had that juvenile and that really tall one standing there side by side. And if it wasn't for the tall one moving, I mean, just a fraction, I would have never seen them or even would have known to look over there, you know, paying the camera over in that direction. That was back in the beginning of fall. Still had leaves on everything. And... Let me look back this way towards the gifting spot. I 
I try to do that every time when I'm leaving. I try to get a shot behind me. I did that like three months ago, I guess now. And I caught a doe walking, a uh, white-tailed doe walking towards me to the gifting area. I don't know if she was coming up because she could smell the apples or, or what. Pretty cool. I love videoing the animals. That's it's always fun. You get to see things that you normally don't notice. You go back. I, when I get home, I like re, you know, right for say you should review everything, and you see things that you would have never thought that they do. The type of actions or habits they have. Pretty cool. I had a subscriber tell me that they saw a white a white being back in this corner where I'm pointing right now back in there and uh, it's not the first time either I, I had someone else tell me right when I first started videoing back here that they saw a white one low to the ground and the, the subscriber that just said it again said it may be five foot off the ground five foot tall small being and what made me think of that is that right there it looks like a broken broken tree maybe or a broken branch sticking up right there kind of looks like it's got a tiny head tiny being but i know it's not it just, it just made me remember that uh, the white being I had someone else tell me they seen a blonde, blonde hair being, but it was just like the top of their hair, top of their head uh, was like really blonde. And I said maybe it was the way the sun was, you know, on it or, you know, you never know. I know depending on how much light's on them, it, it you know, it shows different colors of their hair I've seen them like a bright red black and I think that's it here but a lot of black I see them here black all the time black fur black hair you know all right guys I'm a I'm gonna pack this up and get my butt moving I got a couple of things I need to do on the way back I appreciate you guys tagging along if you haven't already hit that subscribe like and share and uh you seen anything that I didn't point out or you see something and you want to share it feel free to share time stamp it save the time and and so everyone else can see it and I love communicating back and forth with you guys about different things that we see and share. So, you guys have enjoyed the rest of your weekend. I'll see you on the next one. Thanks.